What is going on guys, it is DMG here, and today we are going to be looking at the second Informa Silas Wamangatuka. Obviously a fan favorite because of the original silver card that he had that a lot of people used in order to get silver informs, and he also did get a silver inform, which was again very very fantastic as well. There are some great things on the card considering the fact that he has nearly 99 pace including 99 sprint speed, with a marksman he goes to 99 finishing, he also has 99 dribbling, 99 agility and he also goes to 93 strength as well. Danny Aronson's way back are definitely screaming without the S right now. Now hopefully this guy gets some type of upgrade as well later on whether it be a promo card or some type of team of the season because if you look at his stats it's actually not unreasonable to think he could potentially get a team of the season considering the fact that he has 15 goal contributions in 24 matches for a newly promoted team. And looking at this card now, I genuinely think that that might be the only downside to his card is that weak foot. So again, if he does get a team of the season, which fingers crossed that he actually does, then, you know, he's going to get boosted with the weak foot and he could become one of the best players in FIFA. So obviously, first game, Mendy, Veron, Neymar, of course. I'm not sure where Silas would honestly be best. I think he'd be very good as an outside mid or or a winger just because of that blistering pace and then he could cut and sigh which is great but I do want to try him at striker because I do think he'd be decent there oh sends him through sends him through Silas okay okay can he get around Mendy oh my god but he gets back oh my god beautiful beautiful it's <laughs> that's not <laughs> I'm sorry that's not beautiful it's a hell of a shot but <laughs> that was that was lucky that he passed it right back to us. Look at him go. Look at him go. His dribbling is actually quite good for someone who doesn't have a lean body type. He's actually not bad. Just bang it again. Oh my god. Look at him. Look at him go. That's what you get with the marksman right there. He obviously has amazing pace. You don't need to do anything with, the, like with, with his pace. But you add a marksman to him. 93 strength with someone who's also 6'2". It's disgusting. Oh my god, look at this man. Look at this man over here. The five star skills, and see, that's what makes him a little bit different. Is with, yeah, he obviously has a two star weak foot, but with the five star skills, you can use certain skill moves and certain maneuvers in order to get it on that strong foot of his. God, like, look at him go. Look at him go. Are you kidding me? Dude, I'm sorry, no, no. 99 pace with 93 strength, 99 finishing. Like, I'm sorry, that's that's meta as hell. Like, it, it's, it's, it, it, it's his world, all right? It's legit, it's just his world. He's one of the very few players that I have felt so comfortable with when it comes to dribbling. His dribbling is some of the best I have actually ever used. Hit him up. Deco, beautiful pass. All right, two-star weak foot time. Nope, doesn't. He uses his strong foot anyway. And he's literally got a double hat trick 30 minutes into this game. How's his passing? That's not bad. Silas again. Like, it, am I am I gonna have to like literally skip through certain goals of his? So we finally get the rage quit at 8-1 when Dabala finally scored a goal. Someone besides. Waman actually scored seven goals for Waman Gatuka in the very first game. Like I said, with the pace mixed with the 99 finishing, mixed with the, what, 93 strength that he has with a marksman? Yeah, he's gonna be deadly at striker. Like, there are some players that get up to, like, the high 90s with some type of chem style, but they don't feel fast for whatever reason. Waman Gatuka, he feels like 99 sprint speed. He actually feels like that. This man has Navas and Adama at center back. He's having a good day. We scored seven goals with him in the first match. And then I see Adama and Jesus Navas in the defense. Ed v. Ed. Silas! No, 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 no. Did he, did he really, did he really just... Duncan, beautiful. African king. 
Oh my god, he can do link up play. He can link up the play. He should have nearly gotten like another pass to assist earlier to the game. He can shoot, he can run, he's strong, he can head the ball, he can link, he can pass. I'm about to be screaming without the S myself here soon. It's Adama versus Silas. I mean, let's be real, that's, that's actually a hell of a matchup. Oh, get out. Nah, get out, Adama. Get out, Adama. W remember when I said that it'd actually be a decent matchup? Yeah, for babies. For idiots, maybe. Everyone would actually know that Silas would win it. Come on. Oh, hello. Hello. We don't need, like, S Silas? Yeah, he's obviously wonderful. We don't need, we don't need him to score goals, though. Because we got everyone else. We're fine. Look at, look at this. He makes space. He makes space, look at this! And then he can go in, and if the game wasn't trash at dribbling, I could have actually done something there. But oh my god, his spacing is wonderful. Okay, so maybe not as complete of a performance from Silas this time around, but nevertheless, he's still absolutely dominating with two goals and an assist so far. Oh, you bet. Oh, you... No. No. So this time around, again, Wamangatuka gets a 10.0 rating, 4 goals and an assist, so he was not involved in pretty much every single goal this time, but he was involved in the majority of them, so well done to him once again. Alright, last game here, what do we got? Is this a full, this is a full Brazilian team? You know what, that's, that's different. Alright, Waman, I'm not expecting much, just the same performance you've been doing the last few games. Don't know, don't know about that one. What the f- Silas, beautiful, beautiful. Silas brings us within one. Okay, we're doing better, we're doing better. Just one more, just one more, that's all we need. Just one more, one more goal and we're, we're fine. One more goal and we're fine. Silas, come on! Dude, this guy just kind of has just been passing it around the back, come on. Silas, please! <sighs> okay, okay. He brought us back. He brought us back. Silas, please. Like, the pass from Deco was bad. Why? Why is passing this game so bad? I don't know what that was. Silas? <laughs> Come on. Duncan. Duncan! That's... that's something else, man. So that was it for the gameplay. Obviously pretty disappointing to end on that note, just because, you know, it was a player I thought we were better than. Uh, but, I mean, it is what it is. He's, Silas still brought us, you know, into the game. So, f you know, fair play there. Out of the four games that we played, we got 14 goals and three assists. Now, uh, again, that was only that was an extra game that we played, which I did not record just because it was a very frustrating game that, you know, was going you know, to be not worth including into the, in, into the video. So 14 goals, three assists, did extremely well. For someone that is 67k and obviously very, very fast, physical, can finish I think he's worth a super sub he's one of the better right wingers and you know there, there's not a lot of good right mids right wingers in this game we have a lot of left mids and left wingers so to see him on the right is really really nice um, you know again hopefully he gets a team this season or some type of promo card where his weak foot would get upgraded because without a doubt that is his biggest weakness so that is going to do it for this video guys thank you so much for watching this has been DMG peace